name is Rob Curry. I'm professor and head of the Department of Entomology at the University of Manitoba. I'm an expert in bees and wasps and all things stinging. You may think that wasps are all bad, and particularly this time of year when they're getting in our uh, food and they're possibly stinging us when we go outside. But there are many good things about wasps, and we have to remember that. Uh, early in the year, wasps are busy foraging on other insects. They eat caterpillars and other pests that uh, forage on plants in our gardens. They pollinate plants. Because the wasps are important for the environment, we don't necessarily want to always kill them unless they're causing hazard. We usually try and live along with them, and uh, one of the times you do have to do that is often when you're out in your yard or in uh, area where you're going on a picnic. Uh, there are a number of ways that you can uh, enjoy your time outside uh, a little bit more comfortably. The primary thing that you need to do is go around and inspect the site you're in, check and make sure there's no spilled food on the table, look under the table, see if there's any chips or old cups and dispose of them, put them in a nice sealed garbage can. The wasps are social insects and as a result of that, the individual wasps come in they get a nice meal. Uh, first thing they want to do is go and tell their friends. <laughs> and they tell their friends, their friends tell two friends, and pretty soon you've got a, a lot of company at your picnic table. If you have food that's out like this, uh, you should really take it and uh, try and keep it covered up so that the wasps don't discover it and go and recruit friends. One of the other things that's really hazardous uh, is these cans of pop. Wasps love to drink that stuff as well as we do. The other thing that you can do in terms of personal uh, sort of attributes, uh, wasps are very attracted to anything that smells like a flower or looks like a flower. They're looking for sources of nectar to take back to their uh, homes. If you have uh, certain types of shampoo, like apple scented shampoos tend to be very bad. If you have a flowery shirt, that will attract wasps. Uh, and if you do have wasps that are flying around you, it's usually just because they're checking you out, trying to see if you are a flower, if you have food. What you don't want to do in a situation like that is swat at them, because uh, if you do swat at them, that's when they'll become uh, defensive. <laughs>